Dobar dan svima. Hvala vam što ste se odazvali pozivu da pratite današnje aktivnosti. Nakon upravo završenog sastanka Sjevernoatlanskog savjeta sa predstavnicima Savjeta ministara Bosne i Hercegovine, ministar inostranih poslova Bosne i Hercegovine Elmedin Konaković i zamjeni generalnog sekretara NATO Mirča Đoanu će vam se obratiti sa izjavama. Good afternoon and thank you for showing interest in following our today's activities. After the meeting between the North Atlantic Council and representatives of the Council of Ministers of Bosnia-Herzegovina, we just, we just finished, Minister of Foreign Affairs of Bosnia-Herzegovina, Mr. Elvedin Konaković, and NATO Deputy Secretary General Mirča Đoana will give uh, press statements. Gospodine ministre, izvolite. Hvala vam puno. Zaista mi je veliko zadovoljstvo da danas imam priliku ugostiti i pozdraviti zamjenika generalnog sekretara NATO-a i 31. stalnog predstavnika koji čine Sjeverno-Atlansko vijeće. Thank you very much. It is my great pleasure to be able to host and to welcome today Deputy Secretary General of NATO and 31 ambassadors who are part of the North Atlantic Council. Nakon posjete generalnog sekretara Stoltenberga u novembru, ovaj današnji događaj pokazuje zaista veliku posvećenost NATO-a Bosni i Hercegovini, ali i cijelom regionu. Za nas je to u ovim dinamičnim, izazovnim okolnostima, političkim i sigurnostnim u Evropi, veoma važna i jasna poruka. Following the uh, visit by the NATO Secretary General in November, this uh, visit today proves uh, another great commitment of NATO to Bosnia-Herzegovina, to the region. And this is a very important uh, message uh, for us, given the uh, political and security uh, developments uh, here and in whole Europe. Da budem potpuno jasan, dakle, danas se u Bosnu i Hercegovini, u njen glavni grad, kompletno sjedište NATO-a preselilo na 48 sati i kad bi NATO trebao donijeti neku važnu odluku, to bi danas mogao samo ovdje na ovom mjestu. So to be crystal clear, today the whole headquarters of NATO, the top NATO officials moved to Bosnia and Herzegovina for 48 hours and if they were to make an important decision, then they would make it here on the territory of Bosnia and Herzegovina. Osnovna poruka današnjeg sastavanka je vrlo jasna, glasna. NATO je nepokolebljivi pristalica suvereniteta i teritorijalnog integriteta Bosne i Hercegovine. Poruka ne samo onima u Bosni i Hercegovini koji žive i sanjaju neke drugačije scenarije, nego i onima koji u ovim velikim geopolitičkim potresima širom svijeta možda planiraju tretirati ovaj dio Evrope kao neku svoju interesnu sferu. So the main uh, message today is an equivocal uh, message uh, of uh, NATO to uh, sovereignty and territorial integrity of Bosnia and Herzegovina, which is a clear message not only to those in Bosnia and Herzegovina who live or to dream uh, some dreams, but also those who uh, believe that they can make some uh, impact here in those uh, huge geopolitical uh, quakes that are happening. Jako su važne poruke koje smo i od svih zajedno, ali i pojedinačno od svih ambasadora čuli, a to je snažna podrška našim odbranbenim snagama i snažna podrška misije Evropske unije Altea. Dakle, biti dio te kolektivne sigurnosti koju garantira najsnažniji vojno-politički savjez daje nam mogućnost da se bolje pripremimo za svaku vrstu bilo kakvih sigurnosni izazov. So a very important message that we heard from uh, North Atlantic Council as a whole, but also from individual uh, ambassadors, is their strong uh, support to defense forces here, to the uh, EU-led uh, mission uh, Althea, which means to be part of that uh, collective security, to be prepared for uh, any potential uh, events here. Bosna i Hercegovina također se pokazala u ovom partnercu sa NATO-om kao kredibilan partner, jer smo u nekim aktivnostima učestvovali zajedno, poput one u operacijama u Afganistanu i pokazali da i naš nivo i stepen spremnosti za tu vrstu saradnje zaista nije na niskom nivou. Bosnia and Herzegovina has proven to be a credible partner. We also uh, took part in some activities uh, with NATO together, like the mission in Afghanistan, where Bosnia and Herzegovina proved that its level of uh, readiness is uh, not at a low level. 
Nakon svih ovih događaja najavljujemo i neke buduće, dakle ovdje će se dešavati još neki veliki skupovi organizaciji naših vlasti u saradnji sa NATO-om. Naredni veliki NATO simpozijum Partnership 360 bi trebao biti negdje u zadnjem kvartalu ove godine, što još jednom potvrđuje i opredjeljenost i spremnost na zajedničku saradnju. After all those uh, meetings and events, Bosnia and Herzegovina authorities together with NATO will organize some uh, other events. One of the most important one will be probably in the last quarter of this year, partnership NATO uh, 360, which yet another uh, proves the uh, level of our cooperation. I za kraj, još samo jedna moja lična observacija. Danas više nego ikad žalim zbog odluke prethodnih vlasti da Bosnu i Hercegovinu sa jasno definisanog puta punopravnog članstva u NATO prebaci na kolosijek saradnje sa NATO. Saradnja sa NATO je veoma važna, možda krucijalna za Bosnu i Hercegovinu, ali tu pogrešku da nemamo jasno definisan put, bez obzira što imamo i usvojene zakone koji nam to garantuju, smatram slabošću prethodnih vlasti, I jako mi je danas žao što u tom svjetlu nismo mogli adekvatno razgovarati. And finally, on a personal uh, note today, uh, probably uh, more than uh, ever, I am very uh, sorry because of the decision of the uh, previous authorities to move Bosnia-Herzegovina from its uh, path to full-fledged membership in NATO to uh, cooperation. Although we have uh, laws who support that cooperation is good, and I'm glad that we have uh, cooperation, but I uh, consider this one of the great weaknesses of previous authorities. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much, Minister Konakovic, dear Elmedin. Uh, thank you so much for your warm uh, welcome. Uh, it's good to be back in Sarajevo. You mentioned that our Secretary General visited just a few months back, but the Council visited Sarajevo in 2010, so this is a visit long overdue. Hvala vam velika, ministre Konakoviću, hvala vam puno na toploj dorstu doštvici i dobro je biti ponovo u Sarajevu i vi ste sami napomenuli da je generalni sekretar bio prije par mjeseci ovde, a zadnji posjet Severoatlanskog vijeća je bio 2010. godine. Also, uh, I'm very happy to be uh, here with the North Atlantic Council, 31 allies, and Sweden, soon to become the 32nd member of the most successful alliance in human history. Dakle, jako mi je drago što sam danas ovdje sa Sjeveroatlanskim vijećem, sa predstavnicima 31. zemlje plus Švedska, koja će uskoro postati 32. članica najmoćnijeg saviza u istoriji. Bosnia and Herzegovina is a long-standing and close NATO partner. Bosnia and Herzegovina is a long-standing and close NATO partner. Today we discussed the security situation in your country and its implications for stability in the broader region. Today we talked about the security situation in your country and its implications for stability in the broader region. Because what happens in Bosnia and Herzegovina matters for the security in the Western Balkans. Jer ono što se dešava u Bosni i Hercegovini bitno je za sigurnost Zapadnog Balkana. And what happens in the Western Balkans matters for all of us in Europe. A ono što se dešava na Zapadnom Balkanu bitno je za sve nas u Evropi. NATO strongly supports the sovereignty and territorial integrity of Bosnia and Hercegovina. NATO snažno podržava suverenitet i teritorijalni integritet Bosne i Hercegovine. Secessionist policies and divisive rhetoric undermine stability and hamper reforms and the well-being of your people. Secessionističke politike i retorika podjela podkopavaju stabilnost i koče reforme. All political leaders must, must work together to preserve unity and safeguard national institutions. Svi politički lideri moraju raditi zajedno da bi sačuvali jedinstvo i zaštitili državne institucije. So, Minister Konakovic, I welcome your strong commitment to reform and to Bosnia Herzegovina's Euro-Atlantic path. I stoga, Ministre Konakovic, upozdravam vašu snažnu predanost reformama i putu BIH ka punim euro-atlanskim integracijama. NATO has been committed to your country for many years. NATO je predan vašoj zemlji već godinama. Supporting your reform efforts, including through our defense capacity building package. 
podržava vaša reformska nastojanja, uključujući i kroz naš paket za izgradnju odvrbenih kapaciteta. To help strengthen your capabilities in areas like crisis management, cyber defense and countering terrorism. Pomažemo vam ojačati vaše sposobnosti u oblastima kao što su upravljanje vanrednim situacijama, cyber odbrana i borba protiv terorizma. These reforms make Bosnia and Herzegovina more resilient and more secure. Te reforme čine Bosnu i Hercegovinu otpornijom i sigurnijom. And offer a brighter future for all your citizens as you continue as we strongly support the continuation of your Euro-Atlantic path. I nude sjajnu i u budućnost svim vašim građanima dok nastavljate sa vašim nastojanjima na vašem Euro-Atlantskom putu. We appreciate the contribution of your country to our common security. Bosnia Herzegovina is not only receiving support, is also giving back. You have been in Afghanistan, as the minister mentioned. We are very happy to see that you're taking part in the, in the effort of NATO to go to the next level of our preparations. I'm very happy and proud to see that an infantry brigade has been certified as a top level standards. This is a two-way street for strengthening security in the region and in the whole of Europe. Također cijenimo doprinos koji vi dajete našoj sigurnosti, dakle Bosna i Hercegovina ne prima samo nego i daje, učestvuje u toj kolektivnoj sigurnosti, kao što je već ministar napomenuo, učestvovali ste u Afganistanu i dalje ste spremni da sada na drugom nivou učestvujete u tim našim zajedničkim nastojanjima. Jako mi je drago da je vaša borbena grupa Lake Pješadije certifikovana na tom velikom, na tom najvišim nivou i da je spremna za učešće u operacijama. So we stand ready to continue to dynamize our political dialogue and strengthen our practical cooperation. Tako da stojimo spremni da nastavimo sa našim političkim dialogom i da ojačamo našu praktičnu saradnju. And NATO's headquarters here in Sarajevo will continue to coordinate our support to the European Union-led operation Althea under the Berlin Plus arrangements. A NATO štab Sarajevo ovdje nastavit će koordinirati našu podršku koju pružamo operaciji Althea Evropske unije u skladu sa aranžmanom Berlin Plus. So thank you again for hosting us. This will be two, two days of very intense visits, understanding of your country's needs. And as somebody who has dedicated all my life, professional and political life, to bringing my home country of Romania into the Euro-Atlantic fold, I can say one thing. It's your decision how fast and where you want to go. But there's absolutely no other truth that all our nations that joined the Euro-Atlantic family in the last 25 years since NATO and the EU have enlarged are better off, are more prosperous, are more secure, are more self-confident and give to our citizens better lives. That's a reality and it's up to you and we hope to continue our partnership with your, with your very important nation uh, all the way. Dakle, hvala vam još jednom, ministre, na gostoprimstvu ovde. Ovo će biti dva dana jako intenzivne posjete koje ćemo iskoristiti da shvatimo koje su potrebe vaše zemlje. I na kraju dozvolite mi da kažem nešto. Ja sam cijeli svoj profesionalni i politički život posvetio tome da pomogne moje zemlje da postane članica ove dvije organizacije. Naravno, na vama je da vi odlučite koliko brzo ćete ići, u kojem pravcu ćete ići, ali mislim zapravo da 25 godina dokazano je da nakon proširenja ovih organizacija, nakon što su ove organizacije proširile, da one zapravo nude bolji život i bolju perspektivnost građanima. And also the minister is a superstar in my whole country, in Romania. Uh, he played and he won the championship in my country, so anytime you come to my, to my country, minister, you'll have the best reception ever. I dakle, još jednom da kažem da je ministar i superstar u moje zemlje, jer je tamo igrao košar, ko osvojio je prvenstvo, dakle svaki put kad se pojavite, opet ćete zadobiti pažnju javnosti. Gospodine ministre, zajedniče generalnog sekretara, hvala vam. Mr. Minister, Deputy Secretary General, thank you very much. Once again, shake hands and thank you very much. Thank you.